This is an instructional video for timing the 1.6 Volkswagen uh, engine. Uh, what you want to start off with is removing your timing belt cover. You're going to make sure that the cam is positioned with the intake and exhaust valve uh, or lobes on the cam in the up position. Uh, and you'll notice there's a slide in the back where you put in a locking plate. After you've done this, you want to make sure that your crank is in the top dead uh, center position, which you'll notice there's a, uh, a little indicator mark in and a zero mark on the flywheel. Next, you'll move on and put your locking pin into the injection pump uh, through the injection pump sprocket into the mountain bracket, which is located here. Uh, once all those things are done, um, you can loop the timing belt through and tension. Make sure you do put the proper amount of torque on the timing belt or you could have some serious problems down the road. Um, once all those things are done, you're ready to put in your timing gauge to actually set the correct pump timing. Uh, you'll see that there's a timing plug back here that unscrews. With that out, you have a dial indicator with an adapter that screws in. When you have the dial indicator in, you want to put a socket on the crank gear and you're going to turn the crank in the opposite rotation of what normally the engine would do. So when you start to rotate that you'll see the needle on the dial indicator start moving. It moved a real little bit and then it stopped. When it stops you turn that over to zero and then you go with the original rotation of the engine back over to top dead center. And you'll see that that gauge now reads about 30 millimeter or 0 0.30 millimeters. So what you'll do then is loosen up the mountain bolts for the pump. This pump rotates and you just slowly rotate over until you get the correct amount of lift. Uh, for this engine, it's anywhere from around 0.8 to one full millimeter of lift. Uh, once you've reached the desired amount, you just go back over and tighten down your pump mountain bolts. And you remove your gauge, install your timing plug back in, then you're ready to uh, reassemble the uh, valve cover gasket and prime the pump and start the engine.